This is the bookworm's first time, so today we're doing a fun day making fortune tellers out of special origami paper. But you can use normal paper too, just cut it into squares. First step, put it the white way round. Then you fold it in half. Make sure you do this neatly guys. Done that? Mm -hmm. After that you unfold and do the same thing on the other side. Be sure to pause the video if we're going too fast. Next step. You fold the corners inside the point. So the point in the middle and this corner on the side. And crease nicely. It should look a bit like an envelope once you've done three. Be sure to like and subscribe our video. And click the bell button to get messages of every time we update a new video. Finish. Now we turn it around so it's plain. Make sure that you don't bend these. And we do the same thing on the other side. The point might be a bit faint, but you should be able to see it. It looks a bit like a more tiny envelope when you do three. Now we're at the final step. This step is a bit hard. Finally, you fold this in half so that these flappy bits are on the inside. You insert your fingers inside the flaps here. And if you be following on, then this should work. And then you carefully close it inwards into a fortune teller. Okay. Fix your fortune teller by putting your fingers in these holes while you, your thumb holds the holes down and then you can just maybe update this a bit as well on the back. Time to colour! In these fortune tellers, the first thing you want to do is open it and you can find like all these different flaps with lines in the middle. So if you take a pen or a pencil, you can write one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. And, and so if you can see should look like that. Every time you open it, you can have a different thing in them, so they can tell your future, like uh, what would your first one be? The thing I would put for one and two is you like butter, something like that. And just carry on till you fill the whole thing. Next, when you fold it all up and you put it back to its natural form. If you put it in half, then you can write like blue, green, yellow, and red. 
Or you could use the colours to colour in this. It might work better on a simple plain white one. And when you get it all folded, you can try it on your friend. Which colour do you like? Green, blue, yellow or red? Blue. Blue. B-L-U-E. Which number would you like? You have the option of four, three, eight or seven. Four. F-O-U-R. Choose another number. Four. What's my fortune? O-U-R. Your fortune is that you will regret a decision you make. So next off we're going to be doing, in our next video we're going to be doing flowers. In our next fun day video we're going to be making fun origami flowers. Well thanks for watching you guys. Bye. Bye. See you next time.